In this tutorial, you will learn how to create variants for your design in ORCAD Capture. Step 1. Within the File Manager panel, right-click on the .dsn file and select Part Manager. Here, you can see an informative list of all components used in the schematic. Now select Common under Groups and right-click Update All Part Status. Step 2. Within the Part Manager, you will see various groups. Clicking on Common lists all the parts in the schematic. Clicking on Coupling shows you two subgroups, Assembly 1 and 2. Click on each of the groups to see the parts listed. You can review the groups listed and create any others that are necessary. Let's create a new group. Right-click over Groups and select New Group. Enter the name of the new group as Connectors. Then right-click over Connectors and select Subgroup. Now create two subgroups, CON2 and CON all. Return to the common folder and select J1, 2, and 3 from the list and drag it to the connector folder. In the CON2 subgroup, right-click over J3 and select Set Part is not present. This means that for this version of the design, Part J3 is not necessary. Step 3. Once you're satisfied with your groups, create different BOM variants. Right-click over BOM variants and select New BOM variants. A dialog box will pop up. Enter Variation 1 in the Name field and select OK. Your first variation is created. Similarly, create another variant and name it Variation 2. Drag folders Common, CON2, Assembly 1 from Coupling, and Assembly 1 from Video Filter to the Variation 1 folder under BOM Variants. Then drag folders Common, CON All, Assembly 2 from Coupling, Assembly 2 from Video Filter to Variation 2. So now, we've created two BOM variants. Step 4. Generate reports for different BOMs. Select Variation 1 and right-click to see the types of reports that can be created. Select Standard BOM. In this GUI, you can add or delete properties which you want to see in the report. Within Select Properties, click on Distributor and add it to the output format. Similarly, add other properties too, like the distributor part number, manufacturer, and manufacturer part number. Export to Excel is selected as the default choice to generate the BOM. Select OK. Within Excel, you can adjust the rows and columns, edit headers, and use it for manufacturing purposes. Easily generate different BOMs for each of your product variants from the same schematic.